Hey there, I've been having a lot of trouble with uh, Docker containers being created on a default port and it being in use, like port 8080 or port 80 has been a real problem for me and it's no clear and easy way to do it. But thanks to both people I know and Stack Overflow, there is a solution. So this is the post title. Laravel say I'll have to change the local dev domain. And I've got to go to the dot env file or environment file and this time we're just going to change the app port so we can change the laravel sale right so and it's just here okay in again in the project folder you can see i'm using my windows file directory but it's on the linux side and edit with notepad plus plus and you just add the extra line i've just pasted it port 89 Whatever one you know is free, and I'm just going to take a wild guess and say port 1234, and save that, and then close it. Again, so I go back to Docker. Let's stop the custom port container in full. And if I do that, make sure I just select all of them. Press run and okay, this still hasn't worked, All right? So it's gone to one, two, three, four. Okay, it's still something on five, one, seven, three. Before we make any changes to this port, we need to stop it. All right, so you can just do that and then press the stop button. Even better is to just close it down, right? And then come back to the Docker compose file, the .yaml, and the Vite port, right? So 5174 and change that to mine was 5173. So I'm just put it up by one. And then if I save that, so I've made the changes with the Docker stopped. So I start it up, select all, press play, and that has jumped to 5174. So making the change to close it, stop the project, and then edit it, save it, close the file and it's worked. I hope you found that useful. I'll see you in another video soon. Thanks for watching.